Igbo land shakes as men invade political meeting, did these terrible things to popular politicians. So guys, let's quickly hear the content of the report. A tense situation unfolded in Abia, Abbas State on Saturday, October 19, 2024, as men stormed a Labour Party meeting, causing Shah House and attempting to arrest a senior party officers. The incident occurred during a local party gathering when over 20 masked individuals suspected to be police officers disrupted the proceedings demanding silence from the attendees. According to high witness accounts, the masked men entered the venue with a clear intention to create unrest, immediately heading toward the high table where the party leaders were seated. Among the political, among the officers targeted was Prince G.O. Ndubweze, the secretary of the Labour Party's local government election committee. In a dramatic confrontation, five of the masked individuals approached Ndubweze and informed him of his arrest. However, the situation quickly escalated when Labour Party members present at the meeting protested the attempt to apprehend Hundubweze. They demanded that the masked men present a warrant for his arrest, which the men failed to produce. The refusal of the masked individuals to show any legal documents only heightened tensions, leading to further outrage from the crowd. In response to the confrontation, more than 500 Labour Party members rallied behind Indubuese the march with him to the Aba Area Police Commands, insisting on accountability and clarity from the authorities regarding the legality of the attempted arrest. They protested against what they described as intimidation tactics aimed at undermining the Labour Party's leadership and candidates ahead of the local government elections scheduled for November 2nd, 2024. Speaking after the incident, Prince G.O. Ndubweze expressed his frustration over the attempt to arrest him without a warrant, labeling it as politically motivated. He accused Governor Alice Oti of trying to impose candidates for the chairmanship position and councillorship positions in the upcoming elections. A move he said the Labour Party would not tolerate. According to Indubuese, he said he did not get any warrant of arrest from any of them and from anywhere, and that even 
He did never knew any of them, whether they are policemen or not. He said, but as a law-abiding citizens, he wished to go with them to the police station. But he vowed that he will never bow to intimidation from Governor Alice Oti Ndubweze said. He further said that he, Ndubweze, will never allow Governor Alice Oti to impose candidate in this local election. And that this is a governor who came to power through a legitimate election, but wants to impose candidates on the party. The Labour Party in Abia, Abia State won't tolerate imposition. So guys, how do you see to this act of intimidation, whereby you see policemen putting out masks to invade a meeting and arrest another political party member without police arrest or police warrant. In the first place, why would they put on masks as if they are kidnappers? These are high levels of intimidation and has also shown that they have been settled they have been bribed by another high political opponent just to intimidate and have their way. And this has sparked a very serious tension in the Igbo land. It is very, very unfortunate that Nigerian political system, when the issue of election is on board, it is always in the form of intimidation form of bribery without fair and, and smooth election process to get the new leaders. Just, it's just, this is just a matter of local government shaming, which they strongly believe that is a grassroots political structure for them to have their way when it comes to the governorship election. So guys, how do you see to this whole matter? Kindly feel free to drop your opinion, your comment on the comment section below. And do not forget to like and subscribe to Bliss Channel. Thank you.